hit rig issues, we've all experienced them. We've all been in an intense PvP situation at least once where we hit the player multiple times but the player is left unharmed. Some of us experience this more than others, with the majority of the player base that seeks PvP experience this in almost every encounter they have. But why is this? Well, this major game breaking issue is partially caused by a disappointing projectile based weapon system that the Sea of Thieves devs just can't seem to wrap their head around. So what could be a solution to this? Well, they could fix a current one? Nah, don't be silly, we've only had that system since the game's release. It's not like for four years, millions of players have learnt these mechanics and grown used to them by now. Oh, I know, how about we completely change our gun mechanics to... hitscan. Yeah. But wait, what is hitscan, and would it even solve the problem? Well, yes and no. But to sum hitscan up, basically it's pretty much drawing a laser from you to wherever your crosshair may be, and if your crosshair happens to be on target, if it's in range, it will damage that target accordingly with no bullet delay or drop off. Because that's pirate-like. Now look, I'm not making this video just a shit all over the devs for trying to fix the issue. I actually applaud Rare for spending time on anything PvP related, especially for facing the issue of Hitreg. But me, like many others, are worried about what Hitscan would do to CFEs, as on its own, it's quite a broken system that somewhat gets rid of the skill gap that we currently have with the projectile based system. And it most likely won't even fully fix the issue. But before we look into why that is, here are some opinions from the biggest content creators in CFEs about Hitscan. I think hitscan will be a good change. No, I think it'll ruin the game. I really hope Rare doesn't go with hitscan. If they do, it's going to ruin the game. That's my thoughts on it. They severely need to modify it to, to somewhat mimic the look and feel of C's. Instant bullet hitting is not... This, it's weird, dude. In games with that have it, ugh, it feels weird. Yeah, I, I don't know. I think hit scans is probably one of their worst ideas I've ever thought of. I'm gonna be honest. What do you think about the possibility of hit scan? I mean, I feel like this game is not it's not meant to have hit scan, in my opinion. It's gonna get to the point that what's the point of using cannons? You can just snipe people off their cannons. I think the hit scan is gonna be a it's not even gonna fix i already talked about this the other day it's basically like putting a band-aid on a bullet wound it's gonna take away a core mechanic of the game just to fix hit reg but it's not even gonna fully fix it because like hit reg will always be there until they fix the server issues it's not like just bullets reg literally everything regs and it's because of server issues so i mean they can do that to reduce hit skin or reduce hit reg but they're not gonna fully fix it until they get better servers as well. So just continuing on from what Noobface said, everything in Sea of Thieves has issues. Whether it's any of the guns, to the harpoon, to the bucketing water out of your own ship. Everything has registration issues and it's mainly because of the servers. What makes the servers so shit is that Sea of Thieves doesn't have their own dedicated servers. They are running off of Microsoft's Azure servers, and correct me if I'm wrong, but they aren't ideal for hosting gaming servers at all. This is why a lot of players experience insanely high numbers of ping, myself included. And this isn't a new thing. Four years ago, players were still complaining about high ping on servers and it's not improving. In fact, over the last few years, as Rare puts more development into the game with more and more content, the servers get more cluttered, which has actually led to worse registration issues across the board. I think a big step for CFEs would be to introduce dedicated servers, which would result in dropping everyone's ping significantly, and in return, I'm sure registration would improve for everything, not just weapon play. Not to mention, if they do decide to go with skin, it will significantly destroy the skill gap, and anyone with half decent aim will be able to jump on and destroy anyone that's played for years. All it will take is a little bit of getting used to how the game feels. But what do you think? Am I completely wrong about the entire situation and do you think hitscan would be a positive change? Let me know in the comments as I am somewhat concerned for the future of the game. But thanks for watching.